Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Heather, this is Honest Homemaking, and I have no idea what we're doing yet today. It's Tuesday, happy Tuesday. Zach has been to the dentist, and now he's sipping his tea. He got hopped up on laughing gas. I can't, I really can't <laughs> drink anything, I, it just feels weird. Mason is ready. Oh my goodness. This Mason, oh! <laughs> Are you going to get mad? Oh, wait, he's going to get mad now. So, uh, yeah, I have no idea what we're getting into today. We uh, Yesterday we ran into quite a few issues. We had some toilet troubles. Um, Chris had to buy a new toilet and install it yesterday. The floor under the old toilet was rotted, so he had to cut all of that out and put in... It's just a piece of plywood on the floor with a brand new toilet sitting on top of it. Do not lay there and go to sleep. Alex and Leo are still asleep. It's um, 1130, so it's time for me to get started. It's time for me to get them up. Zach is going to try to lay over here and go to sleep because... I'm not. I'm not. Ah! He is. So, I don't know what we're going to get into today. Um, because of our toilet fiasco yesterday, the downstairs is pretty messy. The bathroom is pretty messy. So, I kind of need to do a general cleanup again. But I also, I kind of want to work on something a little extra. So, I'm thinking about cleaning Zach's room. That's and not technically my room. Making him help me. Uh, I, don't, we, I don't know if we've mentioned this or not recently, but... We're redoing the attic into Zach's new room. Oh, wait. Yeah, and it's come a long way. It's actually pretty close to being done. Um, we need to put in the new lights. We need to put in the electrical outlets, and we need to do the trimming. And then we can paint and decorate. But um, I'm kind of thinking about sticking him up there now because Epic. it's all closed in, and he's got a new window. Um, it's just the finishing work that needs done, and I don't know when we're going to have the extra money to finish the finishing work, so, I thought about sticking him up there on an air mattress and cleaning out his old room, so, I don't know, I kind of want to do that, but I also really need to just pick up, and do some laundry, we definitely need laundry done. I could just do a general cleanup and then do the laundry, or I could be really overzealous because it's probably going to take me. How long do you think it's going to take to clean your old room? Five hours. I don't think it'll take five hours, but I do think it'll take at least a couple. I've got all of these new baby hairs coming back in from where I had postpartum hair loss, so I've got a nice little two-inch afro poofing out everywhere. Epic. Yeah, so I'm going to decide what I'm going to get into today, and... Just get started. Plug my channel. Oh, yeah. Also, Zach and I are going to uh, hopefully do a collab video sometime soon. It's going to involve him helping me clean and me playing a game with him. Epic. So, uh, his channel is Enric. You're about to get your shoe chewed on. Bro, I will uh, you <laughs> link it down below. So, go say hi. Um... Or tell him that mom sent you. He'll appreciate that. Are you crazy? All right, what are we going to do today? So I've decided that what I would do today is just do a general pickup and see how things go. And I found this one small little thing that I'm going to try to change out. I hope these will fit. Now that I'm looking at it, they might be too big. I have these bins in the bedroom. And <laughs> Mason's getting in that one. I have these old broken down, you see this guy's broken down shoe bins that have just kind of been, Alexa, pause. Broken down. I'm winded. So um, I thought that I would trade out these old brown broken down bins. That's trash. Um, yeah, sure, Zach, you can have it. As long as it goes in the trash. <laughs> so this is a small thing that I am doing today to make my house a home. I really need to go through the shoes, but um, out 
grown those, hasn't he? Um, but that'll be for another day. Now a hair tie that I actually like. Got some trash in this one and a toy. So let's see, Mason is climbing up my back. Okay, let's see if we can get Mason here without Mason help it. Oh, oh. You fit. Mason. Now he's going to cry. <gasps> so there we have it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh. What are you doing? You want to let me have the blanket. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm a mean mom because I put the blanket up and he said, I don't know why you're putting that up. I'm just going to get it back down. And I said, no, you ain't. I am. So, no, no, he's not. We also need to find something cuter to do with this hamster stuff. Whoa, buddy. He just rolled backwards. Right now, it's just in this blue bin, which works, but it's not super cute. So that is one very small thing that I have done so far today to make our house a little more homey. Get rid of these junked up old shoe bins. Oh yeah, they're going in the trash. Not. Broken down. Nope. Dirty. Rurt. Well, I think that I've finally decided what I'm going to do with my day now that I have pilfered away most of it. It's 2.13. I have about 15 minutes until I have to go get Riley. She's been visiting her dad for a few days. So, um, I have to go pick her up in about 15 minutes. And... I want to get something done today. So I think what I'm gonna do is start decluttering in the kitchen. Um, I'm just gonna start flinging things, grab a trash bag and just start flinging because there is a lot to declutter. There's so much I need to go through and get rid of. And I really need to be very, what is that word? Ruthless. Right? Like I said, all of our real estate in this very teeny home is about... All of our real estate in this teeny home is very valuable. So, I'm going to think long and hard about what is taking up our space. And we're going to go from there. I want to be there and baby dance the night away. I let my head down if I want to just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time doesn't sound like fun you can do better let me show you what a good time looks like you can do better so much better If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what A good time looks like You can do better So much better lose motivation guys I was doing pretty good I do order stuff from Grove Collaborative obviously I have 
a thousand of these almost empty Mrs. Myers cleaners. Um, I don't know like anything about it. I'm not like a, an affiliate or anything like that. I just like the products. So I order them. Um, I will. Oh boy, kids are going to fight. I don't know if I have a referral code or not. Um, if I do, I'll try to link it below. Because, you know, why not? Oh. Let me show you what I just did. I'm going to pour my off brand dish soap in here and overflowed it. So let's talk about old yicky houses. Okay, so this is the drain from the toilet. Okay, it's in the kitchen. Like, it, why? Why is this how they put this here? So it's all covered in nastiness. I'm going to go ahead and clean this up. A lot of this, this did not look like this before. It's where Chris was working on the toilet and all that debris and stuff fell down from where he had to put in a new subfloor. So all of that needs cleaned up and, you know, there's more of it right here. So I think that I'm going to stop with the decluttering today. I have a few more things I have to put away. Um, also, I have, I have another question for you guys. Did any of your parents, did you grow up storing medicine in the kitchen? I don't know why, but I, my mom always had like a container of medicine in the kitchen. So it's something that I do. To Chris, this is very strange. This is a very strange concept to him. Medicine goes in the medicine cabinet, which is obviously in the bathroom. Well, for some reason, I... Like, I've tried to stop this habit, but I just, medicine always seems to find its way to the kitchen. So, um, I have to find something to do with that, too. But, um, I think I'm going to stop the decluttering today because it's very easy to get overwhelmed. I opened up these two cabinets down here and suddenly felt very overwhelmed. So, I'm going to save those for tomorrow because... It's a work in progress and we don't want to burn out. I did all of these cabinets over here in the bread box and the top of the bread box. So that's progress. I need to take this upstairs. I need to, this is for cleaning out the Durango. Chris got this for me, which is coming in a video. And I'm just going to put this little bit of stuff away. Clean that mess up, and that will probably be all for today's video because I still need to edit this, and it's 3 o'clock. Edit and upload. Kind of behind a little bit today. That's okay. We are still making progress. there you have it our not totally clean but much cleaner than it was counter look how homey is that I even lit a candle and this was from Zach they spelled his name wrong it's Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y for those of you who don't know when Zach was a baby he went to daycare um, and I worked so look how teeny his little fingerprints were Look at his little face. 
that's baby Zach. So what do you what do you guys think? Who does he look like? Leo, Mason, there's a glare, so it's not quite coming out. It's looking a little bit like a zombie baby. It's a little creepy, actually. Alright, well, there is my youngest baby crying. Look, look who's back. Look who's back. And show them your new earrings. She's got angel wing earrings. Aren't they so cute? So uh, that's going to be all for today's video. I'm going to get this edited and uploaded for you guys. And we will see you tomorrow. I'm going to feed this hungry kid. She came back from her daddy's hungry. <laughs> Bye, guys.